everyone, so this video is going to be a sketchbook session. In these videos, I just kind of draw freely in my sketchbook and talk about stuff and you just get to see me kind of sketch and feel free to also sketch with me while you watch this because I love drawing two videos like this. So here's my blank page. I actually have only a little bit left in this sketchbook. Um, so I'm going to go to this page and I have my tea. This is from the restaurant so that's why there's a lid on it. <laughs> so I think to warm up I'm going to start with some studies. I'm going to be using some markers I got from Miniso which is a kind of like a Japanese dollar store but a lot of things are from China also. Um, these are like brush markers. These are um, just some double-ended markers and I'm also going to be using my Ohuhu markers which I haven't really used in a bit because I forgot I had them to be honest. So I'm going to start by just sketching out some animals uh, just to kind of warm up a little. This is the pen I like to sketch with. It's a ballpoint pen, but it's really... I just love sketching with ballpoint pens. This is just a little photo of a squirrel from Google Images just to help me learn how to draw squirrels better because they are really hard for me to draw for some reason. I'll probably get into some like character design later in this video. I just want to warm up with a couple quick animal sketches because that always helps me. Because I just find animals the most fun thing to draw. When you look up just squirrel on Google Images, it's, it's a lot of like strange specific photos. Like there's, there's not a lot of like generic squirrel photos. They're all doing something weird. Like reaching their arms out or like falling or with just their mouth open. This, is, this looks nothing like a squirrel. That looks more like a squirrel, I think. <laughs> oh, and also I'm back to two videos a week now, which I'm really excited about. So I'll probably do, um, most of the time, every Tuesday will be a sketchbook session and then every Friday will be um, a different kind of video. It's like a speed paint or character design or tutorial or tips or something like that will be on Friday and then sketchbook sessions will be for Tuesday because I really like filming these videos. I might try these new colors I got. They're not the best quality but they sure do give a texture. <laughs> might do one more squirrel drawing. That looks terrifying. It does not look like a squirrel. Why are squirrels so hard for me to draw? It's also because I'm not really warmed up, haven't drawn today yet. That looks more like a squirrel. I think it might be fun to design some monsters. I think that's something, or like creatures or something like that, because I've been really wanting to do that. I do a few more squirrel gestures and then we will move on. Oh, this picture is really cute. I have to try drawing it. It'd be fun to do just like a squirrel, like a squirrel illustration, like a close-up. Dramatic shot of a squirrel but with something else to it. So it's not just like a normal squirrel. This doesn't look like a squirrel again, but it's something. <laughs> Maybe it's time to move on to other stuff. So I kind of been wanting to draw like creatures or monsters lately, but I don't know what exactly. So I'm just gonna see what happens, I guess. Maybe this one will be kind of frog-ish. So these are kind of frog-like, but they're not exactly frogs. This kind of looks like a fish. I haven't really drawn fish in a while. Maybe that'd be something fun to do. Like, I really like drawing animals with like, 
clothes, like human clothes on them or like doing a human activity. Um, but I'm not really good at creating like new creatures. That's not something I'm that uh, good at yet. It takes me a lot of time to think of anything. Give me a lot of really weird ideas before I like anything. What about a walking fish character? This one has a sweater. What about a fish bird? A fish bird. Someone with a pet fish bird. This is so strange. <laughs> Just kind of doodling whatever now. <laughs> I didn't realize how nice of a pink this was. I tried to redraw this over here, but it just ended up looking worse. So I want to probably turn this into an illustration, um, just like a portrait of this person with their pet walking fish on their hand. I think that would be a lot of fun to do. So I'm probably going to do that. I might add a little like scenery around it. But I'll block it off so it catches my attention. I'm gonna try to do some nicer sketches. Or, no, I'll just see what happens. That's usually what works best for me anyway, so just see what happens and not try to force anything. So people with pet fish that are out of water is what it seems like I'm drawing today. The hand's looking kind of, kind of weird, but it's fine. It's just a sketch. <laughs> Maybe her hair will be very blonde. Oh, this marker has a lot of ink in it. It's very juicy. And maybe her sweater will be gray. I never really do gray. Looks more like blue than gray, but that's okay. Nice pink sweater, brown hair. Orange fish. Gotta dull down this pink a little bit. I like this little doodle. It's kinda 
kind of cute. I'm like barely talking because I find it hard to talk and draw sometimes. Some days I'm just really focused. Let's choose a different hair color. I want brown for this one. Well, that's like exactly my hair color. <laughs> Cute to make these a little sticker pack to like fix them up digitally maybe and make them a sticker pack maybe I don't know I just I just like the way they turned out I think they're kind of cute like she's playing with her fish so is she and she's kind of like taking it somewhere I don't know I kind of like how those turned out I had a lot of fun with the sketchbook session uh, let me know if you drew along with me and what you drew or um, what your favorite doodle was that I did I started with some squirrels and some of them didn't look like squirrels and some weird monster things. I might come back and fill this page a little bit more. Um, and then I moved on to like fish, lots of fish, and I found a color that I really liked, which is this nice peachy coral color. And then I had fun with like characters, which I didn't think I would today, but I had a lot of fun. So I really hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one.